All right, guys, welcome to the channel. Today we are going to be unboxing and taking a look at the HD60S. So I already took my knife over here and uh, ripped off all this shitty plastic. I already opened it and checked it out, see what's inside. But I'm going to let you guys see what's inside. Um, so the Elgato HD60 is perfect for game capturing or recording any HDMI supported device um, or console. So example, the Nintendo Switch, PS4, Xbox One, it would be great for, perfect for recording your gameplay. Um, so we're going to take a look at what's inside the box. So first off, I already took it out. But you get this little shitty instructions manual or warranty manual. You don't need that crap. Just throw that away. Um, so the Elgato actually runs to your computer with a USB uh, type C. So that's really nice because the USB type C is a lot more reliable than the USB micro, uh, micro USB cable that like is on the previous Samsung phones. I actually hate those ones because the prongs always end up getting all bent out of shape and everything and they always end up disconnecting and connecting. So that's great, they uh, switched over the type C. I believe, I'm not sure positive, but I believe the HD60 is a micro USB. So that's a big improvement for that. Uh, we also got an HDMI cable it comes with for your monitor. And then of course the console itself. So the console itself is actually, uh, it's actually really small. It's, it's nice, like the little like device, the capture card itself. It's very small. Fits right in the palm of your hand. Personally, I'm going to take a piece of uh, 3M uh, double-sided tape, put it on the bottom of here, and hook it onto my desk like that so it's not shifting around everywhere. It's a good method to keep stuff in place. I do it with a lot of my uh, USB hubs and stuff like that. So yeah, that is the Elgato itself, uh, the USB, and then the Type-C uh, port. And then now we got, we can't forget about this. This is one of the most important things that come in the Elgato. Is the sticker. Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? Not really. But yeah, but yeah, you get a little sticker with it too. So that's cool. Um, so yeah, I'll show you guys how to hook this up. So you're going to want to hook up the Type-C port right here. As you can see there, hook the Type-C uh, charger right there. And you're going to run that to a USB 3.0. And then after that, you're gonna take your HDMI, uh, that's your HDMI in, and you're gonna put that to your console. So I'll give you guys a quick little example here. Uh, I have my Nintendo dock here, I'll move my stuff out of the way here, and I'll give you guys an example. So here's the capture device there. Here's my uh, dock. Um, if you guys haven't seen uh, the Nintendo Switch dock, it's like this. And then you got your HDMI out, your USB, and your power adapter. Uh, you're going to be wanting to hook up your HDMI in on here to your HDMI out. So I'll give you an example. So you're going to hook it up like this. So we got our HDMI in plugged in and then hooking it up to our console here like this. I have, if you guys have a Nintendo Switch, tell me what you guys think about their docks. I think they're just like so flimsy and cheap. I think it's like a really not well put together like item like I, I feel like they could have done so much better but uh anyways that's not the subject right now so anyways we got our hdmi in to our elgato here and then now this spot the out you're going to want to connect that to your monitor so and then the display will come up on your monitor and then you're going to want to take your type c plug your type c in right here like that and then this USB is obviously gonna go into a USB 3.0 on your computer. Everyone has 3.0. If not, I think you can hook it up to USB 2.0. It's not a big deal. But yeah, so that's how you're gonna to wanna to have it hooked up. It's pretty simple. They're actually, uh, they actually give you instructions right in the box how to do it. Right here. So anyone can hook it up. It's pretty simple. I'm sure you guys will be able to get it, no problem. So yeah, that is basically it, guys. We are going to now quickly hook it up to my computer and check out the uh, Elgato software. Actually, uh, it says to uh, download the Elgato game capture software to get started. So we're gonna go download the software and then we will continue the video. All right, guys, welcome back to the channel. So you're gonna wanna go on Elgato's website now and go under downloads. Uh, I'll show you, I just typed in Elgato software and then hit downloads. And you're gonna wanna download the game capture for Windows 10, 64-bit or later. So I hit download, so now we got it downloading right here. So you're gonna wanna quickly open this up. 
and I'm sure you'll have to go through a couple process things to start it up. Uh, next, uh, nobody usually reads this stuff. I'm sure they're taking information from you, but what? Uh, next, uh, I don't see. Okay, no, that's the information. Help to improve game. We're not gonna let them take our stuff. I got a sound capture. Uh, yeah, sure, we'll do that. And then uh, hit install and we'll have Elgato to our system in a minute. So now I'm gonna hook up my Nintendo Switch while we're waiting. All right, guys, so after you get your game capture software installed, you're gonna wanna open it up. And as you can see, we ha it's working perfect and it's actually really fast. Like, I thought there would be kind of a delay between the game and um, the TV. But honestly, it looks almost identical. Like, the resolution on the TV looks a little bit better, obviously. But, like, literally, it's almost the same. It looks great. Which it should be when you think about it because the Elgato is actually between, between the uh, TV and the console. So, it's almost instant game, like, instant playback. So, yeah, guys, that's how you hook it up. And that was a quick little un unboxing for me. That was my first time doing it. So if you guys enjoyed it, drop a like, uh, hit the subscribe button if you want to see more videos from me. And in the future now, I will be recording maybe some Mario Odyssey. And also, I'll probably be going uh, next week. I pre-ordered uh, Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu. And uh, on the 14th of November, it comes out. So be sure to check out my channel then. I'll definitely have a gameplay probably for you guys. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. I'll talk to you guys later. Peace out.